everyone! Welcome back to my channel. So, um, after my last video on how I organized my stuff, I got a lot of you asking me about some of my favorites because I have so many things. So, I haven't done a favorites in quite a while and I thought that uh, I might be able to do an updated favorites. So, there are some that might be repeated, but these are my current favorites that I'd like to share with you guys. So this is what it looks like. It comes with the standing drying dock and the uh, brush itself as well as the charger but I don't have it here and it attaches on here. Or you can stick it into the um, slot here and you can charge it like this. So um, I've always wanted a Clarisonic for a very long and I decided on the Aria because I was googling on reviews on this. And they were saying that um, for new newbies, um, they would recommend this. So yeah, so this is... Um, what it looks like. Uh, I, it comes with a sensitive head. I bought it at Sephora um, for $270. So um, it comes with pink, white, and I'm not sure of the last color, but I obviously bought the pink. So next, uh, I definitely featured this before as my Bioderma Sensei Bio. And I really like this. Uh, I already said enough in my previous video. So that's that. And Next, I'm not sure if I mentioned this, but my favorite product from my DRX skincare is the Maxi. So this is just vitamin C, and yes, I did mention it um in one of my very first few videos um about my skincare routine, so you can check that out. Next is a gift uh from Fairy from Other Party, so thank you. Uh, she got this from me in Korea and it's just the 3 Concept Eyes Kabuki brush. It's so soft and I really like it. Not to mention it's pink. It's so pretty. La. Following that, uh, makeup. So a couple of my favorite blushes this month. Um, they are the Makeup Forever High Definition Cream Blush. Second Skin Cream Blush. My favorite colors are 210 and 410 which is a pink and a coral respectively. And I definitely mentioned that the HD Loose Powder was one of my favorite and now it comes in the press form. So this is what it looks like and it's so handy for me to bring in my makeup pouch when I have shoots to touch up. Because uh, let's compare it with the original Loose Powder. It's so much thinner and it's much handier to carry around. Plus you can apply this with a puff if you like but I definitely recommend a brush. Maybe like this Kabuki, but I use it usually with the Makeup Forever Kabuki brush. Next, um, VDL Tin Bar Milk Colada. Um, this is a pink color shade. Really, really love it. I'm wearing it today. I've been wearing it a lot, and you know, it just really looks very natural. Next is Dr. Jack Plus's Bounce BB Balm. It's like this cushion BB that you use it everywhere nowadays. So here's what it looks like, and you know, it's like cushion on cushion technology, so it's supposed to give like a softer, more airbrush finish. I'm wearing it today um, with some concealer as well as my um, HD powder to set. Next, um, mascara, uh, ZA Perfect Action Smudge Proof, really really like this. So this one is um, not waterproof, it comes off with warm water but I really like because the fibers really last. I have oily eyelids and they don't smudge like even on my bottom lashes and they come off very cleanly with water. So I really like this. Next, um, Bobbi Brown Stick Concealer. My go-to now because um, I, just, I really like the coverage it has. This, I'm not sure, let's see. Face Touch Up Stick in scent. Next one's also another gift is uh, Creme de Violet from 3CE. It's just this duo with like pink and purple. Very 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 pretty. And after that is my One Day Tattoo from K Palette Real As Lasting Eyeliner 24 Hours in Brown. And lastly is my eyelash color from Shu Uemura. Okay, this is really like too bright. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, I really like this because you can really get to the inner and outer corners of your eye. I own the original Shu Uemura eyelash color as well. Like as compared, 
comparing both, I much prefer this, but my sister still prefers this. I don't know why. And yeah, I think I've gotten to the end of this um, favorite. So I hope that you guys enjoyed it. And if you do, please give this a thumbs up and subscribe. And I'll see you guys here next time. Bye bye.